World on a Wire German, Welt am Draht, is a 1973 science fiction television serial, starring Klaus Lewitsch and directed by Rainer Werner Fassbinder. Shot in 16mm, it was made for German television and originally aired in 1973, as a two-part miniseries. It was based on the novel Simulacron 3 by Daniel F. Galouillet. An adaptation of the Fassbinder version was presented as the play World of Wires, directed by Jay Scheib, in 2012. Its focus is not on action, but on sophistic and philosophic aspects of the human mind, simulation, and the role of scientific research. A theatrical remake entitled The Thirteenth Floor featuring Vincent D'Onofrio was released in 1999. Topic. Plot In the present day, Cybernetics and Future Sciences Institut für Kybernetik und Zukunftsforschung new supercomputer hosts a simulation program that includes an artificial world with over 9,000 identity units who live as human beings, unaware that their world is just a simulation. Professor Volmer Adrian Hoven, who is technical director of the program, is apparently on the verge of an incredible secret discovery. He becomes increasingly agitated and antisocial before dying in a mysterious accident. His successor, Dr. Fred Stiller, has a discussion with Gunther Laws, the security advisor of the Institute, when the latter suddenly disappears without trace, before passing on Volmer's secret to Stiller. More mysterious still is the fact that none of the other IKZ employees seem to have any memory of laws. Meanwhile, one of the identity units in the simulation attempts suicide. This unit is deleted by Stiller's colleague Wolfang, to keep the simulation stable. To investigate the reasons for the suicide, Stiller contacts the contact unit of the simulated world. The unit, called Einstein, is the only identity unit who knows about the simulation, and this is necessary to run the program. In an attempt to become a real person, Einstein switches his mind into Wolfang's body while Stiller is in contact with the simulated world. Einstein gives Stiller an explanation for the mysteries, vanishing memories, and vanishing persons. He tells him that the real world is nothing else but a simulation of a real world that is one level above. This knowledge causes Stiller to slip into insanity. The other, real, people interrogate Stiller, and he is threatened with death, incarceration, and involuntary commitment. Stiller is finally able to convince Hahn, the IKZ psychologist, of his theory. The latter soon dies in an accident that is pinned on Stiller, marking him as the suspected murderer of both Hahn and Volmer. Stiller flees and searches for the necessary contact unit who can connect the real world with the real world a level above. He survives several assassination attempts and discovers the contact is Eva, projected into the simulation as Volmer's daughter after his death, with whom he believed he had once had a romance. Eva tells him he was modeled on the real Fred Stiller, a person whom Eva loved, but became mad with power from directing the simulation in the world above. While Stiller is programmed to die in an ambush, Eva switches the minds of the two Stillers and brings the simulated Stiller into the real world. Topic. Music The Marshall folk song, Westerwaldlied, and standard German love song, Lily Marlene, are both featured in an extended scene in which Stiller seeks temporary respite in a cabaret. Topic: <laughs> Cast. Klaus Lewitsch as Fred Stiller, Masha Rabin as Eva Volmer. Karl Heinz Voerau as Herbert Siskens, Adrian Hoven as Professor Henry Volmer, Ivan Desney as Gunther Laws, Barbara Valentine as Gloria Fromm, Gunther Lamprecht as Fritz Wolfang, Margaret Carstensen as Maya Schmidt Gentner, Wolfgang Schenk as Franz Hahn, 
Joachim Hansen as Hans Edelkern Gottfried John as Einstein Rudolf Lenz as Hartmann Kurt Raab as Mark Holm Karl Scheidt as Detective Stuhlforth Ernst Custer's bodyguard El Hedy Ben Salem bodyguard Rainer Hauer as Inspector Lenner Uli Lommel as Rupp Heinz Meyer as von Weinlaub Ingrid Caven as Yushi Eddie Constantine as Man in Car Rainer Langhans as Waiter at Party Topic. Release A completely restored version was shown at the 60th Berlin International Film Festival in 2010. It was also released on Region 2 DVD by Kinewelt, Arthouse as part of the Arthouse Premium series and by Second Sight in the UK. It has since screened at the Melbourne International Film Festival, New York's Museum of Modern Art, Rochester, NY's Dryden Theatre, the Harvard Film Archive, San Francisco's Roxy Theatre, the Cleveland Cinematheque, Nashville's Belcourt Theatre, the University of Colorado at Boulder's International Film Series, and the Los Angeles County Museum of Art in 2010 and 2011. The film was released on Blu-ray and two-disc DVD by the Criterion Collection in February 2012. See also The Thirteenth Floor Simulated Reality Simulacron Virtual Reality Simulacra and Simulation